are in front of a C12 Caterpillar engine and uh, we are going to practice with the Kaplan Luri about the process to remove uh, the intercooler and, uh, and the heat exchanger. Uh, we are going to start removing uh, the pipes um, in order to remove uh, part of the intercooler. This, uh, this uh, aluminum pipe, of course we need to remove the exhaust elbow uh, this is the aluminum pipe of uh, the the air pressure coming from the turbocharger entering in the intercooler and uh, and after after that the temperature of the air is reduced and enter in the combustion chamber with low temperature to avoid vapor lock at the same time we are going to remove those pipes uh, to get access to the heat exchanger and we are going to remove the caps of the heat exchanger we are going to clean the heat exchanger and we are going to verify the process to replace the sinks. The exhaust elbow is here and, and by that. And uh, this is the intake, the intake of air at high pressure to the intercooler. That air is coming from the cool cool side of the turbo. Yes. The turbo suction air from the air filter compress the air and the air fully compressed enter here. After that is cooled and enter cooled into the combustion chamber. And after that, a lot of grease to put them back that area. Normally, you replace those okay. those rings. Okay. And what about here? Uh, okay, this is a special gasket because uh, uh, this is uh, usually uh, <laughs> a, it's a semi-metallic gasket. No, okay. normally you replace that gasket. Okay, so when okay. you order, uh, when that, you, you order, order the the, the gasket, you receive this gasket. You receive the gasket here in the bottom with the intake manifold, okay. and both gasket this one and the other one. And, uh, and the orange. And the orange. Mm -hmm. okay. Captain, let me uh, let me uh, show to you something. Uh, what is this? Those are your filters. That's the the pump. That's the secondary oh, filter. Secondary filter. And this is the priming pump. No. Okay. This is the priming pump. Okay. And uh, look at this. From the output of the priming pump, the fuel enter here, circulate in the in the heat exchanger, and return over there. Uh, but uh, you have another fuel cooler here yeah the primary fuel cooler here so this is the primary fuel cooler you have two fuel coolers okay nice no that's interesting yeah. interesting try to remove the entire element. This is the element that we replace when uh, the intercooler is damaged. You remove that one. The housing normally stay over there because uh, this is in good condition. This is the input of raw water. The raw water circulate here, return over there, and goes out here. And this one enter in the elbow of the exhaust and bye-bye. This is the element, we are going to remove this hose and we are going to remove the, the part completely. Okay, this is the element that you replace. This is the component. The air enter here, cool it, the raw water enter this one circulate over there and goes out this is the element inside of the intercooler 
is the element located here in this place. The air coolant enter over there. Okay, great job. <laughs> great job. This is the process to this assembly. And uh, now we, we can remove the caps of the heat exchanger and verify. And after that, we pull them back. We are ready to remove the component of uh, the heat exchanger. The o ring should be replaced and uh, the, the other end should be removed because uh, the element is going out through this side. To do that, we need to uh, remove the alternator. And uh, yes, this is, uh, this is the next step. Remove the alternator. Okay, we are going to remove the cup. Okay, we are going to check. Look at the, the sinks are completely eroded. Those sinks should be replaced now. Yes. And look at the condition of the heat exchanger. Yeah. Yeah, we are going to clean that. If you have the, the sink, you replace the sinks. And always, always when you remove the o rings, the o rings are extended. Always when you remove those, those o rings are extended. After that, you need to replace the o rings. Always. Okay. Okay. All right, we are going to try to remove the element of the heat exchanger. Yeah, go ahead. Other o ring that could be broken, 